Guys, we are so excited for our story today. We are so excited, but it's really weird to teach with no kids. Yeah, and isn't Sean supposed to be in here? I thought he was supposed to meet us here. Where is he at? Oh, my goodness. I'm here, guys. What are you wearing? Scary world out there right now. You, where did you even find this? Um, let's not ask questions we don't want to know the answer to. Um, what's in the bag? Oh, what's in the bag? Toilet paper, of course. <laughs> I was, at, I was at the store the other day trying to get some bread and everybody's buying toilet paper. I don't know why we need it, but everybody else was getting it. I also ended up with 37 cucumbers. Wow. I don't know why. But why do you, I mean, how's that going to help you? Um, again, let's not ask questions we don't want to know the answer to. Um, no, it's just it's scary right now. Like, I'm not coming out of this suit ever. Sean, that seems a little crazy. Crazy? Have you seen what's going on out in the world right now? There's a reason there's no kids here right now. That's true. That's true. You know, even though all this crazy stuff is going on, you realize that we don't have to be afraid, right? Right, because we have hazmat suits on deck that we can wear all the time. I mean, it's a little hot, but guess what? You know, I might lose a little bit of weight wearing it, but hey, you know? Sean, that's not why we don't have to be afraid. No. Why? You know what, actually? Brittany and I, we have an awesome story that we we're going to tell the kids anyway. I think it's going to be perfect for you. It's okay? a story about how to get out of a hazmat suit. Otherwise, we're in trouble. I don't think I can help you there. But you know what? Why don't you come over, take a seat. Will I need the toilet paper for the story? No, I don't think so. No toilet paper for no. the story? Why don't you take a seat right here? And Brittany and I, we're going to teach you why you're, you don't need this. Okay. To make sure you're not afraid. All right. Okay. Awesome. All right. Let us get into character. So a long, long, long time ago, long before Jesus was ever on the earth, there was a king, and his name was King Nebuchadnezzar. Hear ye, hear ye, I am King Nebuchadnezzar. And King Nebuchadnezzar ruled over a huge land. And in this land, there were three people. One, Shadrach, the smart one. And Meshach, the strong one. And Abednego, but you can call me Benny the Brave. Nobody called you that. I'm calling myself that. Shh, just wait. So Shadrach, Meshach, and Abednego worked for the king. They were his most trusted advisors. Guys, don't you think it's really awesome that we get to work for the cake? It's like the best. Yeah, it's Free the best. meals. Gym membership. Well, wow, you're using it. Yeah, definitely. Of course. Love it. I wish that they had something where I could sharpen my brain. They probably do. I don't even know if it's worth it next I to you. Is. Man. You know, I love working for the king. Because he never asks us to do anything that goes against what God wants us to do. God is so cool. He really is. He is so cool. Hear ye, hear ye. I declare that a statue, not a foot tall, be made in my honor of me, and it be made of gold. Gold, excuse me. Oh, yeah, gold. 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 Continue following God. Let's make sure we don't touch this money because we don't want to spread any germs. Sean, it's not the most important. Just oh, okay. Sit down. We're, we're getting it, okay? okay? Just give yeah. us a little bit of time. Guys, what are, what are we going to do? We're not supposed to worship anybody except for our God. Um, let's continue doing that. Okay, yeah, I, that yes. sounds like a good idea. Hear ye! Hear ye, I declare that when the music sounds, everyone must bow down to the statue made of me and gold. I don't think we're going to bow down. Hi, guys. I don't know. 
We're we're not. We're ready to break. We can't, right? Wow, I guess we'll just. Do you think they came to even know? I don't think so. I don't know. Is there all these people here? I think we're okay. Yeah. Yeah. Exactly. Pause again. Um, I think whoever the statue designer is needs fired because it looks totally different than King Nebuchadnezzar. Um, I don't know if that's important to your story or not. Um, it's just a thought. Sean. What? You're making this harder. Okay. I'm sorry. Thank you. Um, <clears throat> oh, you are not bowing down to my statue. And if you don't, I will throw you into the fire. Yeah, I think that's Okay, I'm break. Um, we're gonna we, stand. Yeah, we can't bow down to your statue. We only mm -hmm. serve the one true God. Mm -hmm. Only one. Well, if that's how you want to play this. Into the fire, and for you, I will turn it up seven times hotter than what it originally is. <sighs> Get in there. Uh, we did a such fire. Ba -da -doo -da -da -da, ba -da -doo -da -da. Wait. Guys, Wait. is it kind it's of not hot? It's not. It's kind of cool. Yeah. It's kind of nice. Yeah, if anything, like it. it's a little chilly. Yeah, it's like a little chilly. Yeah, it's great. I like it. Yeah. It's good. It's good work. Yeah. Yeah. On. And it's supposed to be hot. Yeah. Um. Yes. Yeah. Oh, it's not. I'm gonna turn up the noise. I'm feeling good. Nothing. Are you sure there's fire in here? Um. Yes. I clearly see the power. Uh, it's good. Guys, it's good. It's good. It's good. It's good. Yeah, good summer vacation. There are only three of us that got down in there, right? One, two. And one, two, three. Um, what is that? What is going on? Okay. So can we come out now? Yes, please. I don't I, know. This is a joke. Yes, I guess. Get out of here. Okay. Yeah. I, I will survive. Da da do dee do dee do dee da 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 do dee do dee da. Guys, do you know who that? For, did you see that fourth person in there? With us? I did. Yeah. Um, uh, I'm not sure who. It was. I don't know. You I think. I think maybe. Because I took a shower today. <laughs> I know. I think maybe God sent an angel to protect us. Do you right. think that's why the fire wasn't hot? No. Yeah. I think you're right. God is good. He's so good. Your God was so very incredible in order for you not to even be burned a cinch. Mm -hmm. yeah. Not yeah. even a little. Not a little bit. Yeah. Yeah. Don't smell right. like fire. Yeah. I kind of oh. like the campfire smell, but it's yeah. not even here. I don't have to wash wow. these. Yeah. This is great. Your God is incredible. Yeah. You know, guys, I think that something that we can learn from this is that God protects us. He keeps us safe, even if we are afraid. So in crazy circumstances. Faith in all of us throughout fear. Yeah. Faith in our fear. Yeah. That's good. What? You guys snapped me out of my hazmat suit. Yeah. Do you understand now? Understand what? Now we don't have to have fear. We can have faith over fear. That makes sense. Kind of like in the story, yeah. they weren't afraid, and they went in the fire, and God helped them anyway, so. So are you trying to say, like right now, I don't have to be afraid of anything that's going on out there? Nothing. Because God's in control? Exactly. And he's always with you. That makes sense, but it's still really scary, though. So when you get scared, what are some things that you could do to remind you to have faith over fear? Not go back in my hazmat suit. That's a good step number one. Yeah, one thing. Pray. Perfect. Pray is great. Yeah, those are good. Maybe yeah. read our Bibles. Read our Bible. Read some more stories about fear. Yeah. And how we don't have to have fear. I guess that makes sense. Exactly. I'm really excited that you've uh, decided to put the hazmat suit behind you, Sean. I am too, but I don't know what I'm going to do with all that toilet paper and those 36 cucumbers that I bought. I don't know. You could always give them to other people that don't have them. Make That's... pickles, or you can make pickles. Wait. Pickles are made from cucumbers? They are. You learn something new every day. Oh my day, word. Um, can you please pray for us? <laughs> I can. 
All right, let's all bow our heads. Dear God, we thank you so much for how you help us have faith over our fear. Lord, we know that there are some crazy things happening in the world right now, and that there is a lot of illness going around. But God, above all of that, we know that you are in control, that you will keep us safe, that you will keep us healthy, that you are with us wherever we go, that we do not have to be afraid as we approach these next couple weeks. Lord, keep reminding us of that as we spend time at home. Lord, help us have to, to have a great time at home with our families these next couple weeks. We love you so much. And it's in your name we say, Amen. 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 Our Bible story today reminds us of our awesome memory verse for these next couple weeks. So everybody at home, stand up with us. And we're going to say our Bible verse together. Be strong, strong and, and courageous. courageous. Do, Do not be afraid. afraid. For the Lord our God is with us. Joshua 1.9 it also leads us to our bottom line uh, for these next few weeks. We can have faith over fear when we remember God is with us.